Okay, so which type of story is this one? Is it an evidentiary or is it a shocker? To me, it's more of a straight action-y kind of horror type story. What do you think, Lothran? Exactly what are you getting at, my growing worm? Hmm, what, what, what is this? Uh, yes, the story is action-y, as you put it, but that's not really, you know, like all of these ta tales are in some way. What, what are you, what are you talking about? Well, jackal stories, or more accurately, archivist tales and tomes supplied to the jackals fall into certain specific categories, in my mind at least. A few funny ones, those are the very rare though, and then there's a pretty good amount of action-y ones, you get more of those. There's a lot of question-y type stories that are all about getting you to think about a certain topic or a bunch of them. And then finally there's heaps and heaps of piles of gore and scary and monstrous and gross awful stories about how hard and tough and terrible life in the deep well is to the point where nobody ever wants to go there because it's just the worst. Don't go to the deep well. All the bad stuff lives there. <laughs> Don't be silly. It's clearly a questiony story. Okay. No, no, I, I see where you're coming from, but how do you know? Where's your evidence for that, huh? How do you know it's not just a scary avoid this in this situation story? Hmm, Lothran? Hmm? 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 <laughs> it lacks all the signs of a learn from this tale. The story is just Roan, trapped and bound, being dread, dragged towards his fate, then almost getting free, and then encountering another difficulty, and then the story ends with him suffering and his death up in the air to the listener. This is clearly a question E tale, but it's a little too much question -y. You know, it should be more of a different type because that's how they usually set it up. You know, they write it as more a scary with a question -y all over it. Okay. All right. So, in truth, I think Roan is completely boned. Real hard. He's a gonna die. The situation does seem like something that could happen in the deep well, but it lacks the signs or the evidence of ways to react or to stop what's going on, or, you know, anything to connect it to a story that is actually real in some way. If it is a story about this sort of thing and how to defend against it or how to notice it, it's not very well put together at all. Someone made a bunch of mess-ups. And if it's just a question -y story, it's not enough of a not a question -y story to be all that question -y. It could just be us and using the book all the time, but that's, that's the way it feels in my mind. You're saying if an archivist did this, then they should probably be demoted, or at the very least, reprimanded. Yeah, I agree to that too. It's a little too obvious that it's about the question rather than the situation. And P.S. Rowan is majorly boned in all the ways that it is possible to be boned. <laughs> the sliced, slipping hands is what does it for me. Rowan's gonna die for sure. It's not even really a question-y type story. This one isn't... I don't know. Maybe it's just that we were so overworked we didn't notice and pick it out before, and that's really how it got through. But it's done now, so it's in there. It's sad, but true. The figure sounds story-wise too distant. You know, the, the one that was, you know, that Rowan was looking at? 
you know, desperately while he's being pulled off the cliff by the stone. Anyway, um, and he couldn't help Brown's escape, so he's pretty much dead, as dead as a person can be, but still be alive. Ah, I'm tired. <sighs> There's a bunch of stuff to do, too. Okay, I'm calling it here. Good talk, everybody. We gotta get a bunch of noise done. Oof, noise. Good luck, everyone. Stay safe out there. Okay, Lothran, which one do you want to do next? You want to work on next? No, I hit the button. I'm pretty sure I did. No, I hit it. Like, it's done. It's, we're on a different thing now. Uh, oh, no, okay, you're right. I didn't hit the button. 